Well, the weather is changing eventually, and mm -hmm. it's a great time for fall activities and even Halloween activities. That's right. At one of the area's gems, they have a special event happening on the weekends called Boo at the Zoo. Oh, scary. I know, scary stuff. <laughs> We're talking about the Elmwood Park Zoo, uh, which is in Norristown, just about 40 minutes outside the city. And that's where meteorologist Chelsea Ingram is with a lot more on this Boo at the Zoo. Mm -hmm. Hey, Chelsea. Hey, Chelsea. Hey guys, a lot more and a lot of animals as well. We're here with the mobile weather watcher. It's about 77 degrees outside. Kind of still feels like summer out there. I'm joined with some friends. I guess you can call them that. Let's start with Rebecca. She has a skunk. Yes, this is Bree. She is a type of skunk called a striped skunk. This is the uh, type of skunk we have here in our area. They come out, uh, out at, late at night and they eat lots of different things from fruits and vegetables to meat. So they're great to have in your backyard. But Brie does not spray. <laughs> That's what I was told. So good news there. Now let's talk about the snake. I'm a little <laughs> nervous <laughs> to be standing beside you right now. This is Ashley. Not a problem. This is Ozzy. She's a black rat snake, very common snake in this area. She is going to be representing our creepy crawlies here for a Halloween holiday. But don't worry, she's a very calm snake. So she's not going to want to harm humans at all. But she'll stay right here in my arms. Just right, a case. very calm snake, right? Okay, and then we also have a vulture. I'm totally comfortable out here right now. So tell me about the vulture. All right, um, this is Hoover. Whoa. And Hello. Hoover is what's called a black vulture. They're found right here in Pennsylvania. And we actually just celebrated her birthday on Monday. She's turning 11. And Aww. they are a symbol of death, so perfect for Halloween. All right, and you can see all of these animals, of course, at Boo at the Zoo, and that all starts this week. And so I'm joined here by Julia. She's the special events manager. Can you tell us a little bit more about the event starting this weekend? Sure, Boo at the Zoo is every weekend. It's sponsored by Einstein Medical Center in Montgomery. And we have it all four weekends here. We have about eight candy stations set up. So come on, bring the kids out. They can dress up. Um, they have, can go trick-or-treating. We also have an allergy-free station for kids who can't enjoy candy. Um, lots of photo ops and just fun all around. All oh, perfect. And it goes all the way through every weekend, all the way through yes. October, right? So it's going to be lots of fun. And this weekend, as far as the forecast, well, it's looking pretty good, at least for Saturday. And it's going to be feeling like summer out there, guys. So wear your costume. It is going to be a little bit on the hot side of things. 84 degrees on Sunday. 